Today, we give you help when you need it the most. Scattered around the farm, we have these lovely planks that have been standing outside for years and years. And through rain and shine, they have gotten this lovely grey patina. Hilda's sister asked if I could make a sign to help guide their guests during their wedding. And these planks fitted their style perfectly. I cut out the base pieces for the sign using a miter saw and our handy stop lock. The invitation card was handwritten by the bride herself and I wanted to make something that reminded of it. My own handwriting isn't the best though, so I made a template in Illustrator by rebuilding a classic typeface to match the original handwritten one. The first student to tell me which typeface I bastardized earns 10 points for his or her house. I didn't have the possibility to print large enough, but I fixed that with some guidelines and masking tape. The bridal couple are big fans of anime, and some characters from My Neighbor Totoro had sneaked in on the invitation cards. They were admittedly quite cute, so I let one of them tag along on the sign too. I used blue carbon paper and a ballpoint pen to transfer the design to the boards. The sign was supposed to stand outside no matter the weather. So I picked an outdoor paint that we usually use for windows to fill in the letters. I screwed together two pieces of wood to be able to work on both at the same time. These are going to be the posts for the sign. With this done, we have all the parts we need. Thanks for watching! If you want to make sure not to miss anything from our channel, click over here to subscribe. Until next time, be creative!